what would happen to our field when everybody sees themselves as a leader? Not just the people that are sitting in the office and running the centers. When our teachers and our educators start to feel like leaders, it will really ignite and create a spark in our field that will bring our field to that next level of having the best quality out there. And that's what we're all fighting for. We're fighting to be sure that we have the best quality centers, the best quality experiences for the families. And that's what brings our, you know, our field to that next level. So I think it's beautiful that that's been your, your aspect. I'm happy that you mentioned that because it's so important. So you and I clearly are already jazzed up. It's like five five thirty in the yeah. afternoon. We already did our whole day. But I, I for it. those folks, those folks who are like, I can't. I just am not quite that ignited yet. I want to ask you, as as our early childhood coach, what do you see? What do you think really makes people be hesitant to see themselves in that way? What is that? You know what? There's a long list, but I think the biggest thing is just society. Society doesn't make us feel very great about what we do, right? We're consistently proving, you know, I'm in Canada. I know, I think you're in the US and it's the same Mm -hmm. issue. We're proving to society that we are important. The work that we do is the foundation of education, foundation of life. And it gets extremely tiring trying to prove that. So I can see where educators and leaders get to a point where they're like, if they don't see it, why do I, right? 